Hey guys, what's up? Zach King here from FinalCutKing.com. I'm so excited to announce Final Cut Pro 10. It's been released by Apple officially, and it was just previewed at the Las Vegas Super Meet for all these Final Cut geeks. It was an awesome event. This new version of Final Cut is gonna be legit. I am gonna run down a few of the quick features that they talked about tonight. First of all, completely rewritten from the ground up with support for 64-bit, so the user interface was completely redesigned. And what I'm really excited about is the software actually takes advantage of the Mac OS X, uh, the different features like Coco, Core Animation, uh, what is it, Grand Central Dispatch, and this is gonna speed things up so fast because have you been waiting for the day when you don't have to render? And it's here! Woo! I'm so excited and I'm such a nerd. But check it out. Final Cut can now support 4K resolution with independent playback. It's got a new magnetic timeline, that's what they're calling it, and this keeps audio and video in sync. Um, so no more crappy locking things and having you know V1, A1, A2 tracks, that's gone. Also, you've got automated audio cleanup on import. You've got smart collections for organizing all your clips in, in bins, and I think they're calling them buckets too. And then you've also got color balancing, which it automatically does, as well as people recognition, not facial recognition, but you can tell how many people are in shots. It'll also have the ability to identify shots like medium, wide, or close-ups. So that is gonna be organized for you when you're done importing and that's gonna be so stinking nice. They said they're focusing on three things mainly, and that was the image quality, the organization, and then the timeline. And oh boy, it looks beautiful. I'm trying to post and find some good quality photos from the event, I didn't take any, and not many were posted online. So these are all I have. Right now, Final Cut Pro 10 is supposed to be launching in June from the Mac Store online, and it's for $2.99. Now they didn't talk about anything about the studio yet, so you know it looks like Final Cut Pro is being sold separately at this point. I don't know what's happening with Final Cut Express. More information as it comes is going to be posted on my website, FinalCutKing.com. I almost said FinalCutProXTraining.com, which it's FinalCutKing.com. So anyway, super excited to share that with you, and subscribe if you want to see tutorials the day Final Cut Pro 10 is released. I'll see you guys in the next video tutorial.